If you would like to back up onto a NAS device with Retrospect, you must first add the NAS volume to the main Retrospect list of sources. Go to Sources, click on Add, go to Share, and enter the IP address. This includes either AFP or SMB, the IP address, and then the mount point or the share that you're going to be writing your data to during your backup. You also need to specify the username and password. Once you've added the share to Retrospect, you can go to Media Sets, and then you click on Add, and you give your media set a name. You need to make sure the media set type says Disk, and then click on Add. You can then select the disk you want to use as your destination. You can then specify how much of that disk you want Retrospect to use for these nightly backups. Once you've done that, the share will appear under the Members tab of Retrospect showing the path so that you know that it's writing data to the correct volume when you use this particular media set.